welcome to another YouTube video. I am in the car. As you can see, I have my seatbelt on. Um, we are on our way to Dark Side of the Con to do a presentation and to see what there is to be seen. And the camera is shaky as fuck because this road is bumpy. Anyways, uh, we just crossed into the States and we went through our very first toll road, which was confusing to me because we don't do toll roads like that in Canada. But anyways, um, yeah, so we're learning as we go, but we still have a few hours to get to our destination and then we're gonna get set up at our hotel. And then tomorrow the convention starts. So I'm really excited. And I always like going on road trips because you don't know what you're gonna see and who you're gonna meet and all that exciting stuff that happens when, you know, you're just open to adventure for the weekend. So that's pretty great. Brody is over there being very kind and driving me there because I would lose my mind if I had to, if I had to drive these roads. Like I couldn't, I couldn't do it. I'd just be like, give me some friggin' gravel so I can sleep and I'll take the bus. Cause like, yeah, I'm not up for driving in large American cities. But uh, oh, you showing your nails? There, he just got his nails done for the trip with red glitter, which is very exciting. They're very pretty. So anyways, we'll, uh, we'll see you there. Okay, so quick funny story. We're not there yet, but uh, we just stopped at a rest stop, rest stop to get some snacks and pee and all of that. And uh, I don't have any data on my phone. So it just sort of jumps from Wi-Fi to Wi-Fi. And uh, I was literally in the stall peeing and my um, Twitter, my Twitter notification went off, which happens to be Christopher Lee yelling, is this the answer you've been looking for? In his really deep Christopher Lee voice. And I was like, oh my God. And the woman in the stall next to me is like, um, no, in a very timid voice because <laughs> a, a very deep, man's voice just yelled at her in the middle of the bathroom while she was peeing and I thought that was freaking hysterical. I didn't I didn't answer her. I just I just kept going and uh, washed my hands. So I don't know what she's going to tell people, but I, I thought that was quite amusing. This is the beautiful hotel that we're staying at. It looks like a freaking castle. Isn't it gorgeous? Filming unfortunately from the car, but like it's so cool. I'm going to come around and see the front of it here. Look at that, right? What a perfect place for a goth convention. How awesome. Okay, so here we are, day one. Uh, no more lazy traveling clothes for us, only our super awesome outfits for day one. I'm gonna see if Brody can film this for me because that was shit, you guys can't see what I'm wearing. But uh, he is with me and he also looks fabulous. Let me show you what he's wearing. This is Brody, looking beautiful with his new shorter mohawk and makeup brocade pants and fabulous high heel boots. Turn around for us. Yes, this is one of the vests that I made him with the spine and fabulous. All right, and now me. And here's me wearing my dead thing, my autopsy funeral jacket, got my fabulous super high heels on. La, 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 la. It's half your butt. Half my butt. And back up again. So we're about to go downstairs and meet everybody, and uh, I don't know. We'll see. We'll see what the con has to offer us. La la la. This is the vendor hallway. It goes on and on. There's more of it. There's rooms off to the sides with more people and more vendors, and like it's only the first night. I'm so excited. There's so much amazing stuff here. Cool. <laughs> Table of promo material. We're at the Black Friday meet and greet. Well, the line's gotten longer, obviously. She's over there, I don't know if you can see her in the background, but we met her. Yay, it was lovely, got my picture taken. So we went to the Stabbing Westward concert last night and it was like fucking amazing. Brody's been waiting like a really long time to see them live. I really enjoyed it. 
And the singer called me out for being taller than him. <laughs> he was fucking hilarious. Um, he was standing up on the stage and he was like, it's because of people like you that I need this riser. And he had this box on stage and he stood on it and looked down and goes, and you're still fucking taller than me. <laughs> so anyways, that was, that was pretty funny. And then he walked and then he walked by us earlier today and was like, hello, tall chick with the mohawk. And I was like, hi. I was like, I'm sitting down, so I'm not taller than you. And he's like, yeah, but just barely. <laughs> so that was that was a really good time. But we had an absolute fucking blast last night. Like, the burlesque was amazing. Stabbing Westward was amazing. We saw a little bit of Bella Morte, which I'm not familiar with. But, like, the people there were really fun. That was a really good time. Like, it was, it was fucking incredible. Also, we um, may have discovered that in the States they sell, like, little wine juice boxes it's like why but it comes with a little juice box i'm very very excited about it welcome to day two today is the day of our panel our presentation which we don't really know what we're doing but we're gonna fake it so uh anyway yesterday was all dead things and velvet jackets today is all Badass studs and awesomeness. Here's Brody, looking badass. And turn around for us. Look at the back of that vest. Yay, looking so awesome. Yay, shake your butt, okay. Now for what I'm wearing. Okay, here's me, my 20 pound jacket. Yes. Ready for the presentation. Actually, I quite like it when I get negative, shitty comments <laughs> because if someone's like, oh, you fucking ugly bitch, it's like, oh, good, that's a new person. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that's a stranger who's found me and recommended, and somehow they've clicked on it and they're there. Um, if, if you really want to get views, there's this really nice phrase that some boxer used, I forget who, some famous boxer, and he's like, pay to see me win, pay to see me lose, come for this, you paid. It. It's like, the fact is you came here, you watched my video, you hated it, I don't care, you watched it. <laughs> you gave me a few minutes of your time, it's ugh, your problem. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Welcome to the morning of day three, the last day of us being here, which is exciting because I'm fucking tired, but also like sad because I've had a really, really good time. Um, unfortunately, we keep forgetting to film the end of the evening when it's still the same day. So we're just gonna tell you about it now. Uh, we went to see an Aesthetic Perfection concert last night, which was fucking amazing. I had a really good time. Um, we saw another band, which I'd never heard of, Adoration Destroyed. I liked them. We went to a panel on oddities. What else did we do yesterday? I did my panel. panel, yeah, which was amazing. We actually had a really good turnout and I had some really positive feedback from people afterward, which was really awesome because I've never done a panel before. I didn't know what I was doing. I just talked a lot and told the truth and uh, people seemed to really like it. And I got some really heartfelt compliments, which made me feel awesome about what I did. So, and uh, we also did a small amount of shopping. Brody bought me this. Yes. See if I can get it all. La, 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 la beautiful portrait of Vincent Price, which is going to be shortly hung up in our house when we go home. So uh, yeah, we're just about to head off to day three, so we're gonna show you what we're wearing. Here's Brody, looking fabulous, day three. Wanna flip around for us, Brody? Show us the back of your gorgeous frock coat, lovely. Your hair's all looking like you're going really fast. <laughs> just showing the details of your beautiful cravat and jacket. You had a good time so far? Excellent. Last chance to wear my birthday dress, so I'll be wearing it out in public for like the third time. Stay 
Look at all the pretty things. All right, we're back at the car. Obviously, I'm wearing my seatbelt. Brody's driving, and the road's all bumpy again. But, anyways, that means we are on our way home from Dark Side of the Con. I had a fantastic weekend. This is actually my first convention ever, anything that I've attended for more than like a couple of hours. Um, and it was amazing. Like I can't believe the amount of awesome panels that there were. We went to everything we possibly could and there was a lot more that I wanted to go to that I just didn't get to go to because there was they were conflicting, they were overlapping. And like, it was great. We did panels, we did parties at night, we watched burlesque shows, concerts, like everybody was really, really sweet and kind to us. And I was actually surprised that a few people actually recognized me from the internet, either from Instagram or from YouTube. And that was like weird and also flattering and very cool. And it was really cool to meet like-minded people. There was a lot of amazing outfits to look at. Like I had a blast. I would definitely go next year. I definitely hope to go next year. Uh, the girl that's organizing it already said that she would love it if I came back and did another panel next year. So. Yeah, hopefully, oh, Brody's giving the thumbs up while he's driving. Excellent, excellent. And uh, Brody was a fantastic model at my panel. Everyone wanted to feel him and touch him, and that's not even because of the clothes he was wearing. <laughs> so anyways, I hope you enjoyed coming along with us on this fantastic road trip. Uh, and if you did, if you could give this video a thumbs up, that would be amazing. If you want to subscribe to my channel, that would be even more amazing. If you want to follow me on Instagram, I'm under Madame underscore absinthe. Same as always. Same on Twitter. If you want to follow me on Twitter, Madame underscore absinthe. Brody is also on Instagram and Twitter. He is under misanthropist. It's misanthro, P-I-S-S-E-D with an underscore at the end on Instagram and on Twitter if you want to follow him. If you ring the bell, you can get notifications for when I put up new YouTube videos for whatever the fuck crazy kind of stuff we get up to next. So... That's it. I hope you had a good time. We sure did. Please like, please subscribe, follow us on social media if you want to, ring the bell for notifications, and hopefully I will be able to take you guys along with me on more crazy road trips shortly.